Swagger makes it easy to document the various web API exposed by your project. The summary of your API is maintained in a JSON-based file called openapi.json. This document is the main document, but we are not required to worry about it in our day-to-day -day life. It is automatically used to create a web page called Swagger UI, which shows all your web API in a colorful human-readable interface. Each web API can be immediately run and tested, and it turns out that Swagger UI is much more easier than using the Postman software. First of all, let us quickly have a look at the difference between Open API and Swagger. Open API is the specification. It lays down the rules for describing the web API. It lays down the rules for documenting parameters, for documenting the responses, and so on. These rules have been described using XML. Swagger, on the other hand, refers to the software tools and applications that implement the above specification. Some of these tools generate intermediate documents such as openapi.json that I was talking earlier. And there are others like that use these intermediate documents to render the API in a well-formatted GUI-based interface. Examples of such applications are Swagger UI and Open API Generator. We shall talk more about Swagger UI later in this tutorial. So, Open API is the specification and Swagger is the software part that implements that specification. Many developers use the two terms interchangeably. So, Open API and Swagger are used interchangeably in day-to-day -day life. These two terms together refer the, to the applications that generate the documentation and to those that present them and to the rules that are used to generate the documentation. Next, let us discuss Swashbuckle and NSwag. Swashbuckle and NSwag are two main .NET implementations of the OpenAPI or Swagger specification. Both of them include a web-based UI called Swagger UI. You may have already heard of that in the past and we have already talked about Swagger UI in this very tutorial itself. The details we will be covering shortly. As an ASP.NET Core developer, we do not have to worry about the finer details of Swashbuckle and NSwag because everything is handled for us by the ASP.NET Core engine. The only thing we need to do is to configure the middleware correctly. So it ultimately boils down to the configuration file where we have to add a few statements and get our things working. We'll talk about that in the coming tutorials. And for now, I'll say you will need the following NuGet package for Swashbuckle. Install package swashbuckle.aspnet core. So once you have this package, then the rest of the configuration can be easily done. We shall explain the process in the next tutorial. Thank you. Let us now configure our web API project to add support for Swagger UI. As we told earlier, Swagger UI is provided by both Swashbuckle and NSwag. We can use either of the two and I shall be using Swashbuckle. The process for NSwag is exactly similar. Open the web API project that we have been completing in this chapter. Locate the program.cs file and double click to open it. First, we have listed the various NuGet packages that must be installed. These have been listed for your convenience so that you can easily set your own web API project. The first two of these have already been added and now we should add the third one for Swashbuckle. 
ओपन द पैकेज मैनेजर कंसोल एंड टाइप द कमांड इंस्टॉल पैकेज स्वैश बकल डॉट ए एस पी नेट कोर हिट एंटर एंड अलाउ इट टू कंप्लीट कम बैक टू द प्रोग्राम डॉट सी एस फाइल अगेन जस्ट आफ्टर द सर्विस फॉर रेजर पेजेस एड अ सर्विस फॉर स्वैगर जनरेटर एज यू सी हेयर एंड आफ्टर दैट वी हैव एनेबल्ड द मिडल वेयर फॉर सर्विंग द स्वैगर यू आई सो दीज आर द ओनली एडिशंस रिक्वायर्ड फॉर एनेबलिंग स्वैगर यू आई इन योर प्रोजेक्ट लेटस टेस्ट द स्वैगर नाउ रन द एप्लीकेशन एंड अलाउ द होम पेज टू ओपन टेक नोट ऑफ द पोर्ट नंबर एंड टाइप द फॉलोइंग इन द वेब ब्राउजर लोकल होस्ट पोर्ट स्लैश स्वैगर दिस यू शू टाइप इन द ब्राउजर हिट एंटर एंड वी ऑब्जर्व दैट अ स्वैगर यू आई ओपन्स स्वैश बकल हैज यूज रिफ्लैक्शन टू ऑबटेन द लिस्ट ऑफ ऑल योर वेब ए पी आई एंड लेट एस व्यू इट इन फुल स्क्रीन एज यू कैन सी ऑल द वेरियस वेब ए पी आई कैन बी सीन लिस्टेड हेयर देर इज अ कलर फॉर ईच टाइप ऑफ ए पी आई ब्लू रेड ग्रीन एटसेट्रा दिस हेल्प्स यू आइडेंटिफाई द टाइप ऑफ वेब ए पी आई लेट्स ट्राई टू रन द फर्स्ट ए पी आई क्लिक द ड्रॉप डाउन नेक्स्ट क्लिक द ट्राई इट आउट बटन वी ऑब्जर्व दैट द एग्जीक्यूट बटन ओपन एज यू आर सींग हेयर क्लिक दिस एग्जीक्यूट बटन एंड वी ऑब्जर्व दैट द सर्वर सेंड्स टू हंड्रेड ओके रिस्पॉन्स अलॉन्ग विद ऑल द रेकर्ड्स फॉर दिस ए पी आई यू कैन ट्राई एग्जीक्यूट अदर ए पी आईज ऑल्सो इन द सेम मैनर आई विल क्लोज इट राइट नाउ थैंक यू